Okay, everybody, once the for Moon and Chill. So yesterday I was doing a little video about a law called 1-522. It's a law that requires large agriculture corporations to label if they modify, if they genetically modify food. Monsanto and DuPont, really large agricultural corporations, actually spent 200 million dollars trying to prevent this law from getting passed. They're paying local newspapers and just doing what they can to not get that law passed. <clears throat> I think it's, it's really necessary to pass the law because consumers need to be able to see what is in their food. You know, I want to know if I eat genetically modified corn. I don't, yeah. So, anyway, so I was making a video, and one hour later, a guy from Monsanto starts commenting on my video. And he's saying, Sir, <laughs> he starts his comment with Sir. He's like, Sir, you need to understand that passing such a law will put these corporations in a severe disadvantage since it will create a negative image associated with genetically modified food. And I was like, man, like, I think in order to create a sustainable society, we need to be completely transparent and honest to each other. You know, we can't have consumers lying to producers just to make some more pro profit. And I, I said, well, you know, if honesty leads to the t leads to the um, abolishment of genetically modified food, then that's the way it should be. You know, you can't start lying in order to, yeah. And the whole thing became like a huge debate, and his comments sound very satanic. In a way, he's saying that humanity should replace nature instead of mix with it and live with it. It's it's a ridiculously hilarious debate, and I'm gonna invite that guy to a show and want to meet him because he's clearly on the absolute opposite end of the spectrum. And I think you know if people with very different viewpoints talk to each other respectfully, it's always gonna be a fruitful conversation. So I'm gonna try to invite him to a show, and yeah, I will I will try to keep you updated with videos how that goes and you can also read his comments if you look for the last video I did um, last video I did on the YouTube Muno channel it's called GMOs in parentheses no one 522